Hello, welcome to VP Guns Online. In today's video, it is the Double Eagle M42. Before we start, a quick heads up. I've had a little cold the past few days. It's beginning to clear up, but I still might sound a bit bunged up. So I'm sorry about that. But I shall try my best and carry on. So, in the box, you have your instruction manual. Because you how to load the gun, how to fire the gun, safety, how to use the various accessories, safety tips. It covers everything you need to know. You get a small bag of 0.12 gram BBs. You get a red dot sight for 20 millimeter reels. You get a pair of safety glasses that are pretty decent. You get a battery for your red dot sight. You get a mock suppressor for the gun, which it does it doesn't actually affect the noise of the gun, but it will give you slightly increased range as it extends the length of the barrel. And you get the magazine, which holds about 40 BBs. And of course you get the gun itself. Now I'm not too sure if it's modeled on an Uzi or a Mac 10. So Mac 10 is basically the American version of an Uzi. So I can't be too sure. First of all, the stock folds down and it also folds up. You do that by simply squeezing in the back bit here and again get up, squeeze in. Pretty simple. The gun is fired like most spring pistols. You pack it back and take a shot. Simple enough. Magazine race is this little black bit here, which I quite like, it means you can just you might see it out like that. So you pull it down and pull the magazine out. But it does make for quite efficient my changes. Again, it's got actually two safeties on it. There's the one in front of the trigger there. You pull it back, safety is on, push it forward, safety's off. And also, when the stock is folded, you can't actually cock the gun. Which is a second safety. Now, the gun itself, well, as you can see as well, it's got a full rails kit on it. The rails kit is plastic, but as it's all going throughout this price range, everything is plastic apart from the stock here and the spring internals. You can take off these rails if you so wish, but I like to leave them all personally. Again, you can attach your mock suppressor that simply just screws on at the end here, just put on a spin. But I don't really like that myself, so I'm gonna keep it off for the video. Again, red dot side, and you put it onto your reels. Now the gun, as I said, it is mainly plastic, but it's surprisingly heavy. There is a fair bit of weight to this gun, and I'm not quite sure where it's coming from. I think there's put some weights inside it to add a bit of weight to it, but it does feel quite nice. Yeah, it fits the hand well. There's not much else to say about this. The plastic, it's um, ABS. It's, it is pretty high quality. If you drop that, it should be fine unless you drop it onto a corner of a brick or something, in which case, how did you even do that in the first place? So it should stand up, stand up to the test of time. I think there's nothing else to say about this. As usual, the link for this gun will be in the description down below there somewhere so you can click on it or copy and paste it or whatever you feel like. And the magazine, I'll show you how to load the magazine now. Normally I'll do this in a shooting test but it's October, it's cold, it's wet. I want to spend as little time outside as possible. So I'm going to show you how to do the um, reloading of it now. First of all you get the spring follower, push it the whole way down to the bottom, then on the back there is a little button that you push down while the spring follower is held, held down you let it go and the spring follower will stay down then you simply put the babies in through a top hole there you can do it by hand you do it with a what do you call it the speed loader is like basically the long tube and you put a red tube through it or you can use a plunge loader this is my preferred method line up Whatever you can do to get babies into that nozzle. 
I'm not going to do it the full way because I am lazy, but as I said, I hold around 30 to 40 dBs. I want it to fold to your, to your satisfaction. You simply get this button on the back of you and you push it down, which results in that. If you need to just push it in, you're done. Cock it and you're ready to go. I'm proving to see if you this actually does work. I cocked this, I showed the safety is on. I know I didn't need to do that, but yes. So that is everything about the gun itself. Shooting test will be, as usual, in exactly 6.3 seconds. Hello, and here we are now for shooting test. And the magazine is loaded, but not fully loaded. I'm going to fire around 12 shots, roughly. Target is again 15 meters down range. And I still have a cold. And that's the shooting test. This is the M42. Link for it is down below. This is BB Gun is online. I am Jamie, and as always, enjoy. <laughs>